How's Cybertruck 2024 safe? Detail of self-driving FSD autopilot, sensor, camera, hardware. Part two. Welcome back to Adam Tech, your go-to destination for the latest in cutting edge technology and innovations. In our last installment, we explored the unofficial crash tests conducted by Tesla on the Cybertruck, shedding light on its resilient design built to withstand accidents. Now, the burning question arises, can the Cybertruck go beyond mere survival and actually prevent accidents from occurring in the first place? Does Tesla plan to incorporate full self-driving, FSD and autopilot, both of which have faced questions regarding their safety features in the Cybertruck? Fear not, we've got all the answers you seek. In today's video, we'll unravel the mysteries of the Cybertruck's state-of-the-art safety features designed to proactively avoid and mitigate crashes. Don't just be a bystander. Join the conversation and become an active participant. If you share our excitement about uncovering the secrets of the Cybertruck, express it by hitting the likes button. Help us reach our goal of 2000 subscribers by subscribing now. Get ready for an electrifying journey into the realm of Cybertruck innovation. Are you ready to buckle up for the ride? Regarding full self-driving FSD and autopilot, Musk expressed strong enthusiasm, stating, We're solving a very important part of AI and one that can ultimately save millions of lives and prevent 10 of millions of serious injuries by driving just an order of magnitude safer than people. This marks a significant advancement in enhancing safety measures and revolutionizing the driving experience for car enthusiasts. On November 13, in a response to a Tesla fan asking on social media platform X when customers would be able to test the company's full self-driving version 12, Tesla CEO Elon Musk replied about two weeks. Coincidentally, this time frame aligns closely with the Cybertruck delivery event date, hinting that the electric pickup might launch with V12 from the outset. According to Tesla CEO Elon Musk, Version 12 of full self-driving will introduce end-to-end -end AI which relies on machine learning and AI to both process environmental inputs and determine the vehicle's responses. Every new Tesla comes standard with autopilot, offering basic features like traffic-aware cruise control and auto steer. Tesla's full self-driving, FSD, enhances these capabilities enabling tasks such as autopilot navigation, auto lane change, auto park, smart summon, and traffic signal stop control. Modern Teslas boast external cameras and advanced vision processing, with the Tesla Model Y, for instance, featuring eight external cameras, 12 sensors, and radar for added safety. Despite the names, Tesla's driver assistance features do not make their cars autonomous. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, NHTSA, regularly reports on crashes involving advanced driver assistance systems like Tesla Autopilot, Full Self-Driving, or FSD Beta. According to the latest data, there were at least 26 incidents resulting in fatalities from August 1, 2019, through mid-July this year. In 23 of these cases, Tesla's driver assistance features were active within 30 seconds of the collision. In conclusion, while the system is not flawless and requires a human driver ready to take control, it represents a significant step toward advanced vehicle technology. The price of Tesla's full self-driving has surged by 200% since its reconfiguration in 2019, marking a significant shift. Three years ago, Tesla revamped its autopilot and FSD packages making basic autopilot standard on all vehicles and pricing FSD at $5,000. As of September 2023, the cost of the FSD system has risen to $12,000. In the race for automated driving systems, BMW is launching highly automated driving features in Germany, set to be available for order by German customers in December 2023. This move, directly challenges Tesla's FSD package, offering a comparable system at nearly half the price. BMW's Personal Pilot L3 claims to provide SAE Level 3 automated driving at 6,000 euros, approximately US $6,800, boasting full functionality even during nighttime. 
The system relies on a range of sensors, including 3D LiDAR sensors for environmental monitoring and utilizes GPS and 5G sensors for information exchange. As of now, whether Tesla's V12 update will achieve level three autonomous driving or if the Cybertruck will come pre-equipped with V12 remains uncertain. On September 28, a Cybertruck prototype featuring a range of new sensors was spotted, as revealed in a video posted by ex-user Peggy Mangat. Notably, the Cybertruck showcased a horizontal beam on the roof, housing two LiDAR sensors on each side of the vehicle. Despite Elon Musk's initial opposition to LiDAR sensors, the video suggests Tesla might be utilizing them for calibrating the full self-driving FSD cameras. Musk emphasized the preference for cameras over LiDAR, aligning with the idea that roads are designed for human visual perception. In addition to this sensor revelation, Musk confirmed that the Tesla Cybertruck will debut with Hardware 4, HA4, replacing the existing Hardware 3, HA3 computer used in Tesla vehicles since April 2019 for partially automated driver assistance systems like autopilot and full self-driving. This indicates that the Cybertruck is likely the first passenger vehicle equipped with the latest iteration of Tesla's FSD computer. HW4 boasts five megapixel cameras, a significant upgrade from HW3's 1.2 megapixel cameras, resulting in a more realistic perspective in terms of colors and overall image quality. Exciting times are ahead for Cybertruck enthusiasts. And there you have it, your comprehensive guide to the Cybertruck's ability to avoid crashes and mitigate it. Did you find this info helpful? Are there specific aspects we may have overlooked? Or perhaps there's a particular topic you're eager for us to delve into in our next video? Your feedback is crucial, so don't hesitate to share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed the ride, hit subscribe, give us a thumbs up, and ring that bell icon to stay in the loop. Your support means the world to us and helps us reach even more enthusiasts. Thanks for watching us, and we'll see you in the next one.